bell icon. Thank you. Hey guys, I'm on UK here. Open was doing well. It's been a long, long time since I last did a video. I'm very sorry about this. Um, there was a few reasons behind this. One was I just started a new job, so I've been really, really busy with work. And then the last, uh, a last minute holiday booking. So I was away for, in Spain for two weeks. Now, uh, the good thing is about being in Spain during this time of the year is there's natural flights and um, when I, I landed at Barcelona airport and I was waiting in the transfer bus I could see flying ants everywhere and they were huge I'm not exactly sure which species they were I'm pretty sure I'm not too sure but I'd probably say they were mesobarbaris because they tend to start around this time of the year uh, late October uh, November time is uh, natural flight season for uh, Mr. in most parts of Spain um, but it was absolutely great you know I got the chance to see them um, in their own country I also seen a few big colonies around the beach area they, they were pretty awesome I was literally standing I didn't even realize you know I was walking down this uh, road and I stopped because I seen ants on the floor I was like whoa what's them and it was a big Mesa colony Mesa, Mesa black colony and I didn't even realize that I stopped still right in the front of the trail. So, all, as you can imagine, they're all just crawling all over my feet. I was like, oh my god, no. <laughs> um, I was going to record it, but unfortunately, when I got the phone out of my pocket, it was, you know, there was no battery left on my phone. I think it was like 10% battery. So when you try and load the camera up to do the recording, it's like, we, you don't have enough power to record. So I was really gutted. I did plan on going back to it, but being on vacation, I just, you know, I just wanted to relax, chill out, get a bit of a tan and come back to England and um, feel the cold weather again, unfortunately. But yeah, I had a great time. I hope all your ants are doing great, guys. Um, I'd like you to comment in the comment section below telling me what species you've got, how they're doing. I want to know this, this information from you guys. Um, but I've recorded here some footage of Lacius Niger Queens that we caught during the nuptial flights. Um, in the summertime, there was two nuptial flights here in the UK for me. And this is a winged queen. She was the second batch of nuptial flights because I separated them into two different boxes so I know. Um, but as you can see she's doing really well, she's got eggs and uh, they look like they're starting to turn into larvae um, but they, they, they really really have surprised me They've, I've never had Glacius Nigers that have laid eggs, larvae and then had workers so quickly as you can see here this is one of the Glacius Niger queens that I caught in the first natural flight now when was this probably like it was like August time was it August? I think it was August time. And now look at it. I've got loads of workers already. Like, it was crazy. I couldn't believe it. Like, I've never had a Lacius Niger Queen um, that I've caught in the wild lay eggs and have workers within just like two or three months. It was, it was, it's something I've never seen before. But she, they, they're doing well. Like, I have God knows how many queens. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do with them all. I'm probably going to put some on my website if anyone wants to buy them. Um, but I, what I will do is I won't sell them until they have workers because I want, you know, people to have a bit of a, an established colony. Um, but yeah, they're doing really great. We've got lots of uh, different queens. Well, not lots of different queens, but we've got lots of Lacius Niger queens. Uh, a lot of them have larvae and I've got a few of them that have the first batch of workers and they've already laid the second batch of eggs. And as you can see in this video, they are turning to larvae already. So they're doing really, really great. I'm thinking I still have two formicariums um, spur, two medium formicariums. So I'm gonna feed these ones that have the workers and hopefully when their second batch hatches then we're going to move them into a farm aquarium and I'll record it anyway guys I'm going to leave the rest of the footage to you guys I'm so glad to be back and I'd like to say a big hello to everyone um, don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I'll catch you next time thanks for watching I'm UK.